please put your hands together for April Brown and It's Complicated. Yeah. Well, hello everybody. How are you feeling? Happy Sunday on this wonderful three-day weekend. Yes! <laughs> I hope tomorrow is filled with a bunch of nothing for you. Hey! So I wrote these songs because love is a lot like a dance. And sometimes that dance is well choreographed and it's smooth like this. And sometimes it's a little awkward, a little stiff. Can anyone relate? There are some days where things just flow and the choreography and the beauty of love. And but sometimes, sometimes, hey, can you snap like this? Hey, come on, snap like this, everybody. joy, it's an honor to share my heart and my stories and my life through the art. And so me and this crew right here, 
we recorded my second album, It's Complicated. We recorded live here in Orlando at Stark Lake Studios. And um, the album will be released later this month everywhere. I'm super excited, still have a little work to do on it. But the project tells a story, tells my love story, and I think it's really all of our love stories that the falling in love, that part can sometimes be easy. The butterflies, the googly eyes, and the poetry and the letters and all of those things, yeah. And it's so beautiful and it's so lovely and it's everything, it's really literally everything that the songs talk about, you know. But sometimes, 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 the little things are the hardest things to do, yeah. Like listening. Sometimes it's so hard to do. Like talking when we need to, it's so hard to do. And though we're trying to find our unity and our harmony, sometimes we lose our way. The song can go a little sideways. Cause it's complicated. It's complicated. It's complicated, yeah. I wish I could show up with all the answers. Everybody wants to be the guru. <laughs> but I don't have all the answers. Instead, I have way more questions than answers. I've been married 10 years. Still have more questions than answers. It's still a daily learning thing. So here's my story. Yes and no, yes and no. Back and forth, off and on we go. Mm -hmm. It's the broken code of broken homes. No devotion, just shame. Well, we might as well be done. But how can I love so sweet? Tell me. Turns out it's complicated. It's complicated, yeah. But I know we'll find it every time. It's complicated, oh. I, here we go. Sometimes we have to start over in love. Simple love, the 
before we were broken hearted. I know we'll find it every time. Give me it's complicated. Hope. Give me my hope. Yeah, 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 yeah. Simple love gets complicated. Everybody in right here say, Love my simplicity. Love my complexity. This Timuqua broadcast is made possible by Opera Orlando. By Park Ave CDs. By Skylo Engineering. By The Schaller Group. Please, let them know that you appreciate their support for Timuqua. We've got to breathe, we've got to breathe Take it slow, take it slow, take it slow mm -hmm. Oh, I'm in love with you, yeah This ain't the honeymoon Gets more confusing every day Sometimes it's heaven sent we get back to hell again Kiss then we make up on the way I know love sometimes hurts I still put you first And we'll make this thing work But I think we should take it slow We're just ordinary people We don't know way to go hey. cause we're ordinary people maybe we should take it slow take it slow oh. this time I'll listen to you Thank you. Thank you. Man, it seems like relationships, there should be like classes on it. Like in high school, in college, you should have to take like multi-level courses 
on relating with somebody because the simple things can sometimes be so hard. And so this next song asks the questions, what are we gonna do with all of our foolishness, all of our brokenness, like when we're faced with who we truly are? Because it's easy to point the fingers and be like, well, if you were just, you know, but it's much more difficult to take a look at yourself. Take a look at yourself. And confront your mess, hey. It's like somebody unscrewed the top of my head. And I'm walking around with no thoughts inside. It's like I'm stuck somewhere between alive and dead. And merely thinking about it, it takes me apart. It's like somebody unscrew the top of my head. I'm walking around with no. Mm -hmm. Oh, grief feels like a screwdriver to the head. Oh, oh, oh. And merely thinking about it, oh, it takes me. A pie. So what are we gonna do? do. Yeah. Walking around with no thoughts inside. Messing yeah. yeah. with you. dreams and crumpled them took my feelings walked on them eh. took my joy ran off with it eh. and merely thinking about it oh it pulls me all apart Absolute lowest, my most broken. Oh, but it's in that place. Oh, that the Lord spoke to me, said, I'm with you and I've got you. As long as we're living, we'll always be broken. And I know it, yeah. But as long as we're living on this side of heaven, then I want healing, I want healing for my heart, yeah. As long as we're living, we'll always be a little bit broken, a little bit crazy.
Jordan Kelly on guitar. Rashad Gurley on drums. So, during that season of just absolute brokenness, I wrote in my journal, well, I just felt so overwhelmed emotionally, so supercharged up emotionally that I could not even process what was happening. You know, has anyone been there before? Where it's just almost, it's overload for the circuit board and you literally cannot think. And so that's where I scribbled that in my journal. It's like somebody unscrewed the top of my head. Like there's nothing in there. <laughs> um, and so during that season, what precipitated that was my husband and I were actually in talks of divorce, yeah, the big D word. You know, you don't talk about divorce, you don't talk about death. You know, but those are realities of the life that we live and that's part of our story. And at the time I was very, very ashamed of that season that we walked through. But right now, I'm so grateful, so grateful to be free. No shame, not afraid. So we walked through that season, we walked through that valley. But part of my process and part of my dealing with it was literally going home to my mom and daddy house in Pensacola, Florida. And you no, know, I just packed up and took the kids and went to my mom's house and we stayed there with my mom and daddy, you know, just to be loved on and grounded and in a lot of ways to be reminded of who you are. Um, so that was my process and I was called home, like something intuitively told me to go home. And as I reflected on that, I likened it to my journey, my relationship with God and with Christ. How sometimes I get far, 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 far from where I'm supposed to be. But I'm called home, called to his side. Fell again, felt again. Dripping legs tangled up in sand.
Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I don't want to keep you in suspense. We didn't get divorced. Okay. <laughs> we didn't get divorced. March 11th um, made 10 years for us. By the grace of God, we made it.
We sing, we play, thank you. But really, for real singers, there's nothing more fun than singing with people. So we're gonna teach you this part. And I got distracted, I'm sorry. <laughs> sing, brother, say. So we're gonna sing your part. It's real easy. Uh. It's real easy. So if you're nervous about singing, just take a deep breath. And it goes one, two, three, burn us down. Real easy, real easy. Wanna hear you sing? One, two, three, say burn us down. Fowler on the keys. My key man, my key man. Sometimes it burns real hot. Fire and desire. Sometimes it burns real hot. I didn't write this song, but <laughs> I learned recently that this song is by Anita Baker. Not Anita Baker, I'm sorry. Aretha. Aretha Franklin. So we'll do it for her and we'll do it for Adele. Cause love it burns real hot. And it's bringing me out the dive Finally I can see you crystal clear Go ahead and sell me out And I'll lay your ship bare The thoughts of your love Remind me of us I can't help thinking That we almost had it all The scars of your love They keep me breathless I can't
not a human. No, you're not crazy, crazy, crazy. Though sometimes you might feel a little bit crazy. Possibly, possibly. You're gonna wish you never had that yeah. Tears are gonna fall. One time, it burns so high like fire and desire. It burned real hot, but it got complicated. And we asked ourselves, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? So we took our mess. We had to face our mess. We had to confront our mess, and then we, then we had to face each other. Face each other. It was worth it, and it was worth it. Love is worth the fire. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, friend. So listen, I'm gonna tell on myself. I watched Divorce Court. I'm not really that proud of it. But listen, Divorce Court is incredibly edifying, okay? At first, it was just like kind of gossipy and weird, but I really get convicted when I'm listening to Judge Lynn render her verdict and give her advice to each couple, because typically they don't divorce. They just talk about each other and then make up at the end like we tend to do. But she said something so simple, yet so profound, and I was like, that's it right there. That is it, that's a word, as some people say in some circles. She said to the man, grow up, and she said to the woman, shut up. And I was like, <laughs> grow up, shut up, yeah. Simple. Some things are not worth fighting for, worth fighting for. But real love is worth a fight forever. Seems pretty far-fetched. Lifetime seems so short-lived. Oh, but if I had to roll the dice on any love, I take my chances on this. Help me say. of which dreams are made oh but if i if i had to put my money on anything i put my money on you I babe no 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 Ooh, yeah i put my money on you baby Ooh, yeah, yeah. broken all the time oh but if i had to stake my heart on anything i stake my
like to introduce my band to you.
you, thank you, thank you. They make it easy. They make it very easy.